Ons Jabeur versus Alina Rabakina was the third quarter final for the ladies Wimbledon for 2023. And both ladies had had different roads to get to this stage. Jabeur entered the tournament as the number six seed and would take on Fre in the first round. This was too easy for Jabeur, getting through in straights, 6-3, 6-3. In the second round, she'd take on the qualifier Bay, and again, an easy win for Jabeur, winning in straights, 6-1, 6-1. In the third round, she'd take on Andrescu, former US Open champion. And after dropping the first set, Jabeur would have to fight back to win, 3-6, 6-3, 6-4, -6 to advance to the fourth round. The fourth round, she'd take on the number nine seed Kvitova, who she had a bad record against, losing four of their previous five matches. But this time, Jabeur was on fire, demolishing Kvitova in straights, 6-love, six 6-3, six to advance to the quarterfinals. Rebecca entered the tournament as the number three seed, and would take on Rogers in the first round. And after dropping the first set, would fight back to win, 4-6, 6-1, 6-2. In the second round, she'd take on Cornet, and after a close second set, get through in straights, 6-2, 7-6. In the third round, she'd take on the wildcard Bolter, who'd won a tournament on the grass prior to Wimbledon. This is no problem for Rabakina, getting through in straights, 6-1, 6-1. In the fourth round, she'd take on the 13th seed, Adaj Meyer, who she had lost both their previous matches to. But unfortunately, Adaj Meyer got injured, with Rabakina getting a walkover, 4-1, retirement. These two have played four times before, with the head-to-head -head split down the middle, 2-2, and their previous meeting actually being at the final of Wimbledon last year, where Rabakina got that win from a set down. If Jabeur's going to win this one, she needs to keep her concentration. In that Wimbledon final, she was off to such a great start, but unfortunately, she just couldn't keep that level, and also couldn't keep her concentration. She's going to have to mix it up as well. Make Rebecca a move. Drop shots, slice, everything to win this one. If Rebecca is going to win this one, she needs to be aggressive like she always is. Big serving as well. If she serves well, she'll be able to win this match probably in straight sets, but she needs to serve well. Unfortunately, Kvitova couldn't do that against Jabir and Jabir just chopped her up. So if she doesn't serve well, then that's going to be a real big problem. Also, the ground strokes, of course, making Jabir move. This is such a fun matchup and we've waited so long, 12 months now, to watch this matchup, we finally get the rematch. I'm going to go Rabakina to win this one. I feel like her game this week has been so aggressive. And the fact she spent less time on court and Jabir having to play a long match against Andrescu a couple of days ago, I feel like maybe Rabakina can get through this one in three, but I reckon it's going to be an epic. Let me know down in the comments below who's making the semifinals.